The residents of Grunau Settlement are currently using the community hall as a kindergarten that caters for 40 children. After the completion of the classrooms, one more teacher will be appointed. Sigrid Klaresip is the control administrative officer at Grunau Settlement. These structures that are being constructed will include two classrooms, toilet facilities and a playground area, also kitchen. These children will be equipped with necessary skills before they can join uh, the primary school. The manager of Anglo-American Namibia Foundation, Richard Cook, says that the responsibility of developing society should not only be that of local or central government. He says that it is the responsibility of all corporate entities to make sustainable corporate social investments in the areas that they operate their businesses. We believe that there's much need in our communities in the south and so we want to plow back into those communities. As you can see yourself, the hall there that's been used for the kindergarten, we, the trustees and, and ourselves had a look at it and we, we, we realized that um, we should do something about it. The tiny settlement of Grunau is home to 800 inhabitants, which is made up mostly of unemployed young people. Sarah Jacobs is employed as an administrative officer at the Grunau Settlement Office and travels every day from Karasberg, which is 40 kilometers east of Grunau. My house is in Karasberg, but my, but my heart is at Grunau because we can be part of the development of Grunau. We can help to upgrade the people, especially the youth in Grunau. Located at the junction of the B1 and B3 main roads, Grunau Settlement is ideally located for investments.